So I was given this, uh, this, this vintage radio, it's probably from uh, late 30s, something like that, 1930. It's an AM radio only, so uh, basically useless these days, I'd say. Um, uh, it's in bad shape anyway, I mean, you can see the speaker, it's got some massive tears in it. Uh, the, the, the case is pretty knackered. Uh, the electronics, as you'll hear, uh, not, not perfect. Um, the transformer is doing all sorts of funny things. It keeps on uh, short circuiting, so you know it's not it's not perfect. Um, but I just uh, thought I'd chuck my guitar into it, and, uh, uh, put a little boost pedal on. You can't see it. It's like it's like right there. Um, see how it sounds. Um, I'll show you. It. This isn't running at full power, so. Right there, that says uh, 145 volts. So we're we're well below full power, um, and this is basically as loud as it gets. Which it, it's a really nice volume. Uh, you won't see, but you'll see. really hard to get any kind of clean sound out of it. Uh, the, it makes <laughs> the sound kind of just gets, gets, gets up and up and up and then it explodes all of a sudden. Uh, it's really in bad shape. It's probably all the capacitors are like leaky and uh, out to spec. Uh, the tubes, well, one of them is falling apart. There is also another tube that isn't even installed. So, you know, it's not perfect. Let's have something else. So that's all. You're welcome.